What's up guys, I hope you're having a wonderful day. So today's video is actually part two of a vlog that is over on my vlog channel. I'm currently at the airport headed to Toronto to do a shoot with Smashbox Cosmetics tomorrow. I'm so excited, I'm only spending like less than 48 hours in Toronto, so I thought I'd vlog it for you guys on my main channel because I haven't really done this style of video on my main channel in a while. Thought I'd catch you guys up on what's been up the past couple of weeks. So I've been traveling like freaking nonstop. It's been totally crazy. The last weekend of September, I was up in Squamish with my family camping. That was absolutely amazing. And then I came home and the next day I left for San Francisco. Uh, if you guys have been following my social media, you probably would have seen all the updates kind of as they came. But I was in San Francisco all of last week and then I was home for maybe two, three days. And then I packed up and went to Whistler and I just got back from Whistler now, pretty much. I drove uh, from Whistler at like 7.30 p.m. and it's now like 9.30 p.m., 10 o'clock p.m. And I'm sleepy, I definitely am feeling it. I've never taken a red eye before, so it should be interesting to see how that goes. I'm not sure how I'm gonna feel tomorrow morning. Ideally, I would like to go to a yoga class and then start on with my like activities with Smashbox, but we'll see how I feel. So fingers crossed that I'll be good. I'm gonna try and sleep on the plane. As you guys know, I can usually sleep anywhere, so I think it'll be fine, but yeah, it should be good. Let's do this. There's a TV in the mirror in the bathroom. That's cool. So I finally arrived and this hotel is absolutely stunning. Smashbox has left some really cute stuff around my room. I can't get over this bathroom. It's absolutely stunning. Um, right now it is 8.43 and there is a yoga class that I was hoping to make at 9.30 so I'm gonna take my makeup off and get ready for that. So the way that I've been removing my makeup lately has ever so slightly changed. Um, I've moved from using makeup wipes to almost always using the face halo product that I showed you alongside with my Clarisonic Smart Profile. You guys know I am a diehard Clarisonic fan. I love that it removes my makeup completely from my skin. It's not just something that kind of gets the surface layer, it actually like deep cleans. So that is the plan. But let's take off this first layer. First layer of makeup, off. Let's go in with my face wash onto the Smart Profile. And this is a face wash that I've been using for almost the past year, by the way. It's from the Zeo line. I'm pretty sure I've showed you guys this before. This also helps exfoliate those like really dry patches that I get. Like you can see how much that just removed even after I already washed my face. So it's pretty crazy. I think it's really important to use something that really deep cleans your skin. My facial lotion is from Zio as well. So a couple of pumps of that. I keep thinking there's like makeup left on my face and it's totally not. I'm just extremely tired with dark circles. <laughs> Oops. Brushing my teeth and then heading out the door. All right, let's go.
So I just took a vinyasa flow class. It was an hour and a half and the instructor was Jody. It was absolutely beautiful and I totally recommend checking this yoga studio out if you are from Toronto. I am so tired. My eyeballs are just like, uh, so. I'm really hoping I can find a coffee soon. I am waiting for my Uber to show up to bring me to a place called Her Majesty's Pleasure. I've heard really good things about it. I'm getting my nails done there and here's hoping they have really strong coffee. Let's nail this red for you, motherfucker. because they want me to arrive with fresh, clean hair. So that's kind of my plan. I need to find some food. I've just been eating like snacking things like granola bars slash uh, like fruit, but I need food, real food, right now. If I have any time left, I will go shopping with Alana, but she is the worst influence, man. I just feel like we're dangerous. We're just dangerous when we shop together. So we'll see how we go. But that is my next little plan. had the sweetest Uber driver I've had in a long time. Her name was Vilma and she was such a sweetheart. She was maybe maybe 65 or 70 years old. I think she was Jamaican and she just had the best energy. Like I got in her car and immediately I just felt joy. We had the sweetest conversations and when she was waiting for people to like pass by in traffic, she was like, you go ahead, sugar plum, it's okay. And just the most beautiful, casual way, that was just the way that she lived. And it just makes me so happy to encounter people like that because the world needs more of it, man. It truly, truly does. And to have such little experiences that lift your spirits like that, People like that are absolute dimes. I love it. I thought since I have some downtime, I'm gonna try out a new mask because why not? Hotel life, right? So the mask I'm gonna be trying was sent to me by Biotherm. As you guys know, I have been working with Biotherm and with Clarisonic over the past couple of months. And so I get sent a lot of their new product releases, which is really sweet. So their latest one is this Biotherm Wonder Mud. I haven't heard too much about it. I just know that it's like a mineral mud mask, which I like the mud masks. I like the packaging. I'm not sure if I love the smell. It's just a very like clean mud smell, which is to be expected as it's a mud mask. Let's see how this goes. I love that it's green. Okay. Our first mask with green microalgae and Moroccan century old clay. In just three minutes, it unclogs pores, removes urban impurities, and reveals a radiant complexion, allowing skin to breathe easier. Well. For once in my life, I'm early. It is 2.58. My skin feels awesome though. The mask definitely was really, really nice. Um, I still obviously have a little bit of redness around my mouth from the eczema or eczema or whatever the fuck it is, but it is what it is. The rest of my skin feels really fresh, so pretty stoked with that. I'm excited to get my makeup done. I don't know who the artist is going to be. The last time I shot with Smashbox, I got made up by a guy named Will, and he was one of their like pro artists or something, and I loved the look. Um, you guys might actually remember that look on my Instagram. I had like really gray lips and really white hair. I loved it, so I'm really looking forward to the shoot today. It's going to be so much fun.
Oh yeah, there's that light. Come on, girl. So we finished the shoot, everything went fantastic. I can't wait to share the images with you guys. Davis is a freaking magician at what he does. I'm so grateful to be here with Smashbox. Thank you so very much. Let's head to dinner. Terrible lighting, but I thought this is better than nothing. I wanted to show you my outfit tonight. I'm wearing a big sweater dress from Lovers and Friends, and I got it on Revolve. I'm wearing my Valentino uh, glam lock bag or glam something bag, and my Tony Bianco boots again. Ugh. My outfit of the night, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my god, I'm dancer posing in heels. Can we just for a moment? Good morning friends, I just woke up, had breakfast and packed up and now I'm on my way to my friend Kaylin's house. We're gonna go film, I'm really excited because I've wanted to film with her for years. So a long time coming, super excited. I just put on a quick easy face of makeup. The lashes are a new style from Socialize that I've been testing out. I have the Kat Von D liner on. I tried new brow products that Benefit gifted me. I'm using the Precisely My Brow Pencil in the shade number three and 3D Brow Tones. They explain this product as being almost like highlights for your eyebrows, which I thought was super cool. So I don't know, I have highlighted hair. I like kind of defining my brows a little bit, but they're looking good, so I kind of like that. So that's been my go-to for brows. And then my cheeks are the Radiant Matte Bronzer from Too Faced. I've been really enjoying that. I'm wearing the YSL foundation, the All Hours foundation mixed with some of the CC cream from It Cosmetics. What else do I got on? I have the Naked Lip Liner from Urban Decay, and I'm going to be wearing this Shanti, Shanti Natural Fragrance from Sage. I absolutely love this. I've been traveling with it like crazy. It smells insane. I gotta get out the door, so I'm gonna leave you here. I will see you at Kaylin's. Hello, sweet boy. Hello, I've been waiting to meet you. So, Kaylin and I just filmed a couple of videos and we decided that her wig is named Samara. This is Samara, the ring girl. Really just want to casually have her in the background of the videos, just draped on the pillow. <laughs> That'd be so funny. <laughs> if you guys don't already watch Kaylin's YouTuber series, you totally should. She's like killing it with the videos, posting every single day, all Halloween content. If you are craving the Halloween, you need to go check it out. I am now waiting for my driver to come and I'm headed back home. My 32 hours in the 416 is coming Woo! to an end. You have to come back. We're gonna go creep some vegan food next time you're here. So much food. I didn't even get to go to Planta this time and I'm no, so sad. No, Planta's the best. I wanna do like full on food videos and I think this would be the perfect person to do it with. I'm going to come Eat and all try the all the foods. foods. All the foods. <laughs> okay, I will talk to you guys a little bit later. Bye. So I made it to Vancouver, plus one. <laughs> and, uh, I am just waiting for my bag. I am hoping that I will get out of here in time to make my friend's birthday party. It is Katie's partner's birthday today, and they're all going out tonight, so I hope I can at least make some after dinner, after dinner drinks. La, la, la. I feel like my brain is in just such a fog. I'm super tired, but I haven't been able to hang out with my friends in a while since I've been traveling so much, and it would be so great to see them. So fingers crossed. Let's get the hell out of here. <gasps> Okay, well I'm gonna go get ready and I'm gonna go find your daddy because I miss him too. <laughs>